All right guys, short video to show you a neat little camera rig I built for one of my personal projects, Dead Fuse, and it's been very useful for getting that handheld look. I'm sure you guys will get some good use out of it as well. To use it, just grab it from my site and open or drag the scene file into any version of Maya. I have a simple little scene here to show you what it can do. You have a target control, and this is identical to a standard target camera in Maya. I've already keyed in a simple camera move, and here it is. Now we're going to use some of these attributes to spice it up a bit. We have a tilt attribute. And we have noise attributes. And these are the attributes that will add that handheld motion to the overall animation. You can add it to position and rotation. The positional value depends on the scale of your scene. I'm going to set it to 100. And the rotational value works well with a low number, something around 0.2. Let's take a look. It gives it that little something extra for very little effort. You can also speed up the motion and offset it, which is useful if you get that odd movement that you want to remove. This lower section here adds camera shake. The camera has a built-in waveform that you can blend to at any time. I'm going to add in some camera shake when this orange ball hits the ground. I'm going to key it one frame before impact at a zero value. And then again, the next frame, when it hits, at a similar value to what I gave the noise. So about 100. I'm going to let it shake for about 10 frames and just key it off. And that's it. Easy peasy. Let's see how it looks. Nice. So you can also adjust the speed and offset of the shake as well. And that brings us to the end of this short video. I'll put a link to the camera in the description below. Thanks for watching guys. Subscribe, ring the bell, and give it a like if you want to see more. See you soon.